Good morning, family. Today is Sunday, and I'm back home from church. I've had a beautiful church service. As a matter of fact, I went to two. But I want to thank you all for stopping by today, and I hope you're having a beautiful Sunday morning as well. Today, family, I would like to share with you all a conversation that I had with Mr. George on yesterday. So I went down to Mr. George. Now, if you don't know who Mr. George is, Mr. George is a farmer here and he has been growing vegetables and fruits for the last 50 years. He learned everything he knows from his father who has been growing in Louisiana all of his life, right? So Mr. George got really deep into a conversation that I brought up to him about growing our food and which way our food is going towards today. This is a message from Mr. George. y'all I'm down here by Mrs. George with my baby girl Judy 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 and look what Mr. George got y'all in case you don't know what that is that's for you persimmons so let's get about what seven I want about seven Judy getting these good for you look at them y'all Oh, you, Mr. George. Thank God for Mr. George. <laughs> All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Top of the morning to y'all, ladies. Morning, Mr. George. How y'all doing? I was excited. I said, I got to go by Mr. George because I know he got these for you. Look. Look. You wouldn't believe all the trees that Storm took. Now one of them trees that dad's on is still standing. Really? I picked them yesterday, Mom. Oh, yeah? Yeah. See, I picked the big one first. Yeah. Because I don't like them to get too big because they get they don't get to stay sweet. Yeah. So I picked the bigger ones first. And I usually pick the other ones like around Thanksgiving time. Yeah. And I told my nephew to go over there and pick me a couple of cases. Them people been buying the hell out of them things. Yeah, well, I, I got I mine. A friend of mine, uh-huh. a lady living next door to us down there. Yeah, I give up, I give up about five hundred of them. I'm really? trying to make me some preserve. Cool. No sugar added all that. Yeah. Glad to be back. Yeah, Mr. Y'all George. be careful around this time of the year buying that stuff out of those grocery stores. Buying what, Mr. George? Bell peppers. Yeah. Eggplant, zucchini, yellow squash. Uh. Green onions, celery, potatoes. Yeah. Greens, they got plenty local here. Don't buy them out the grocery stores, do. There's stuff coming out of uh, southern Texas right now around the galleys. And it's got human manure and human urine. They use to pasteurize and fertilize their fields. So, if them people are sick, some of them might have COVID. Some of them might have cancer. If you buying that stuff because of what it costs, well, you getting what they got. Be careful. Now, the reason why I know that it's like that, that's been going on now over 100 years. And the federal government is more in, in, uh, involved in making money than actually taking care of what these people are selling us because no one over there care about what we eat. That's why y'all can't buy what y'all can't buy what y'all used to get more time to go. They don't, the, the stuff that's good for us, they don't sell it no more. So my little advice to y'all for the holidays, be careful when y'all spending y'all money. Three days ago with my wife, and I don't know I'm going to go in no grocery store. And what I saw in there is unbelievable. And the prices that they're selling their stuff for is ridiculous. Back in 1980, 
went to a seminar down in Homestead, Florida. I was 18 years old then. We went to this convention because we wanted to learn exactly how we can grow different types of produce year round instead of just growing it in different seasons. Right. And I found out that the way God got this world, it ain't gonna work. Mm -hmm. So everything got a season, even, even you. Right. But the film that we saw, you know, I don't know if they knew exactly what they were doing to show us this, uh -huh. but I'm sitting on there and I was amazed. Mm -hmm. Because when I'm looking at how they got pipes that runs from they facilities where they use, use urine and, 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 and number two, they was like recycling it, putting it in their fields because those type of areas down there where that stuff come from, when they have a drought, they can't get no water. So if they can't get no water, they can't make no money. So what they do is they recycle out their waste and people that's sick that's got whatever it goes through this cycling service and they spray the fields with it well of course the stuff gonna grow because what they putting back in the fields is the stuff that they ate from the people right so i'm not gonna say it don't work but i'm gonna say this to you why should you be penalized and you eating something you don't know where it come from and you don't know what's on it right. they're not gonna tell you what's on it right they're not gonna tell you where it come from Right. Oh, they're going to tell you to put a sale price on it. Right. And people like us, we go in there and buy it. So I'm going to address this to you all. Every time y'all talk to me, I got something else to say. But pretty soon, y'all going to know everything I know. <laughs> but that ain't no problem. Just be careful what y'all buy. And y'all go in these stores. If y'all got somebody in there that y'all can talk to, ask them where it come from. More than likely, they're not going to know. Because they don't even tell it to them, and they're selling it. My whole thing is, if you have some space, the best thing in the world to do is grow your own produce. It's very simple. It's, it costs, you know what I mean? It's, you figure it like this. You either pay for the labor and the cost none, or pay for it when you go to these old monkey hospitals. Either way, you're going to pay for it. Hey. So I say like I do. I, you know, we were planning on getting out this business, and my son and daughter told me that wasn't a great idea. Right. That they got a lot of people that's depending on me and my wife. So right. I just started to start thinking about me and start thinking about what God want me to do and how I should be. Amen. So I'm just trying to be helpful there. I'm not telling y'all that for y'all to come to my place or I'm looking for some kind of advertisement. I'm just telling y'all things that they don't tell us. Well, sometimes even the hardest headed people, at least sometimes they white listen. Yes. But the key to your life is not at the hospital. Right. It's not at the grocery store. Mm -hmm. It's not at the bank. It's not at the car lot. It's what you put in your mouth every day. And the stuff that they have out there, it's, I, you know, it kind of hurt me a little bit for me to see what I'm going through. Yeah. Because I would never think in my lifetime as me being in this business now, 50 years, I would ever see what I see. Yeah. And you see, I know this stuff real good because yeah. I can look at stuff and see where it come from. Right. They ain't got to have a stick or nothing on it. I can tell you where it grew and how old it is. Yeah. Well, I was around a man did this 73 years. So the things he taught me, I listened to it. Yes. So I'm going to give y'all some advice. Be careful what y'all eat and who y'all buy y'all produce from. Now, that goes with everything. These fast food restaurants, they whole motive is about numbers. Mm -hmm. They're not concerned with the the importance on what you the nutritional items. Mm -hmm. They're not concerned about none of that. All their mindset is you know, how much money they can make and how much money they got to pay their employees. Yeah. So you get what you pay for. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. George. I appreciate. Y'all have you. a good weekend. All right. Happy Thanksgiving. And if I don't see Miss, I know I'll see her. But look, Happy New Year's and Happy Christmas to you all too. Be careful what y'all spend your money on. All right, Mr. George. Thank y'all.